Everything is sexist. Everything is sexist to people like me. Let's go through the checklist of misogyny. Barbie, do you think that women can have it all? Which breakfast did you say? Okay, I think that I think that says a lot. Okay, I have to ask this simple question. Why the fuck is this even real? Like, w w what's the point of this video? You're, you're, you're talking feminism to a, to a doll. A doll that's, you know, probably responds randomly. Like, this, this isn't like the very first time we have dolls like this. We, we actually have dolls that act this way since the 90s. Responding to certain words. <laughs> what do you expect? I would think Barbie's a feminist. She's had a lot of careers throughout her life. She, she's a fucking fictional character. She's a, she's a fucking doll. I mean, like... Wow, I... I Oh wow! Oh, oh wow! This this hurts. This this actually hurts. The stupid. It hurts. The people who are selling Barbie just sells the exact same toy over and over and over again. The only difference is the outfit. And you know sometimes they try to amp things up, like you know adding a car or you know giving Barbie a dollhouse. And they give her like. Costumes like, uh, let's see, um, fireman, um, florist, doctor, you can name it. That's why Barbie has been so successful. How do you feel about the wage gap, Barbie? I love it. Once in a while, I catch myself dancing, sometimes for no reason at all. Well, instead of asking Barbie some of the dumbest questions out there, maybe you should ask Barbie... Things like the meaning of life. You know, just just ask her that. You know, instead of asking about the fucking wage gap! How about you? Do you dance anywhere and everywhere? Barbie, do you know what second wave feminism is? Well, cereal sounds delicious. I was wondering, um, what do you think about Sheryl Sandberg? Oh, you know what's good? A dream diary. This is so weird. You're, a you're asking Barbie questions about feminism. Yeah, I, 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 you're on the nose on that one. Th th this is totally weird. Like, what's the point of this video? I'm over it. You're so smart. Such okay, a I like it again. Friend. Oh, Barbie just told me that I'm smart. <laughs> How do you feel about the fact that we never had a female president? Not even an itsy bitsy, eensy weensy bit. I'll get some credibility. She doesn't give a fuck about a female president. What she wants is to have a date with Ken. <laughs> know what I want to talk about? Fashion. I don't want to talk about fashion with Barbie. I think we have different senses of style. She has permanently raised feet, and I wear these types of shoes. You might be shocked. Maybe you and Barbie might actually have in common. Both of you have no brain cells whatsoever. Sometimes I get a little nervous when I tell people my middle name, but I'm really glad I told you. What's your middle name? Glad that we have this conversation, Barbie. It can be really fun to play with Barbies. I like you, Barbie. I feel like we we're gonna rise through the ranks together, and you know, be like high-ranking career woman. Yes, an adult woman is going to become best friends with a. a a, a doll and rise in the ranks in order to become president. Barbie for president! And anytime I can help you out, just let me know, because that's what friends do. Oh, I have something I want to ask you about fashion. Oh. I've been working on a story that expresses what I think fashion is all about. Don't like this commercial! Yeah, me neither. Nothing more. Really
much to debunk. It's just me just insulting BuzzFeed for creating this stupid video. And you're probably wondering why I even have a doll. I, I have a little sister, remember? You know, she's, uh, she's currently 15, but she had these dolls since, like, around 6. And, you know, some of these dolls are her favorites. So I just happened to find one, and, you know, and I decided to, why not? I mean, it's appropriate. <laughs> anyway, um... That's all for now. I am the Atheist Gamer. Peace. The game out.